comme un wasabi poil avec au bord Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuhu I am Al Hassan Al Hassan Ahmed I am a tutor in Jamiat Mubashirin Ghana I am a graduate from Al Azhar University that is Cairo Egypt after that I went to do finance and accounting in City University in USA and I hold MBA in finance I was looking forward to get a driving license in Canada after buying a car and a friend of mine who was not an Ahmadi but a Ghanaian told me that there is a Ghanaian who has a driving school but he's an Ahmadi so if I don't mind he will introduce that man to me so that he can assist me and that person's name was Muhammad Sadiq so I got a contact with Muhammad Sadiq. During his introduction to me, he said, you know, I'm a Muslim like you, but I am an Ahmadi. Then my question was that, do you believe in La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah? Muhammad Sadiq replied, he said, yes, of course, I believe in that. And I said, do you perform five daily prayers? He said, yes. I said, according to the knowledge that I acquired in Azhar, this confirms to me that you are a true Muslim. As long as you say the Kalimat Tawheed and you also perform the prayers and the other obligatory uh, things that Islam tells us to do. My brother Muhammad Siddiq further introduced me to an Arab man called Fallahuddin Oda and he invited me and Muhammad Siddiq to his house where I started seeing the MTA programs in Arabic and some of the Akida that means some of the ideology Imam Mahdi has brought. I begin to get myself convinced of the ideas in the Ahmadiyya, particularly when I heard Osas Mustafa Sabit, then I really went home and I did istikhara for several times. And one day I found myself that no matter what question is, I have to accept Ahmadiyya. I called my friend Mohammed Siddiq. And I told him that tomorrow I want to do the bayah. They even asked me to wait. I told him that today God has shed the light in my heart and has given me the order to do the bayah so I don't mind whatever comes after it, so I will accept. Hazrat Mirza Ghulam Ahmed accepting him as the Imam Mahdi and the promised Messiah foretold by Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. In fact, I found that a lot of changes has come into my life. My Iman has increased and my seriousness in prayers also after becoming an Ahmadi has increased a lot. The reason is, is that in Ahmadiyya, every member is encouraged to wake up after midnight and perform tahajjud prayers and pray to God. So since I became an Ahmadi and I started practicing after midnight prayers, I realized that my prayers are always being accepted. Our spiritual leader, Hazrat Mirza Masrur Ahmed, Ayyahu Ta'ala bin Nasrul Aziz, paid a visit to Canada and I had a meeting with Huzur. When I touched his hands in the shaking, my body was shaking and I felt some spirituality which was coming into my body. I can remember in 1992 in Egypt, I saw several dreams of Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam to the point that there was one of the dreams that Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was speaking to me when I met Huzur. And then it came to me that, okay, this dream that I saw about Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, it means that that was in the person of this man, Hazrat Masrur. Ahmed, Ayyadahullah Ta'ala bin Nasir al-Aziz. That actually made me very, very confident that I have done something very good in my life by accepting Ahmadiyya Muslim community. In fact, my wife, she's always happy that she has joined the Jama'ah because it is a Jama'ah which has been created by Almighty Allah through his messenger, promised Messiah alayhi salatu wasalam. <laughs>